What's up to everybody? Thanks so much for tuning in to another video. Be sure to stay tuned all the way to the end of the video because I really want you to get everything that I'm going to share with you. Today, I'm in Mark chapter 10, verse 27, and it reads, Jesus looked at them and said, with man, it is impossible, but not with God. For all things are possible with God. I'm going to read it one more time. Jesus looked at them and said, with man, it is impossible. But not with God. For all things are possible with God. And I just came to encourage you and remind you today that, listen, you need to put that situation in God's hands. See, you've been trying to do it by yourself for so long. You make a little bit of progress. I got to give you your credit. But at the end of the day, it ain't moving like you want it to move. You don't have that peace that surpasses all understanding. You have to choose to literally put it all in his hands. You see, we are the clay and he is the potter. God wants to shape you up. God wants to mold you up. God wants to not only develop you through that situation, but he wants to build your testimony so that you can go out and reach other people. Okay. So there's a lot of things that God is working on behind the scenes that you have no idea about. God may be working on 15,000 things right now, right? And I know you stressing out about this one thing, but I just want to remind you that you better off putting it in his hands. Okay? Because see, God works the night shift. You be sleep at night. God still be up, man. All right? So don't it make more sense to put it in the hands of someone who not only works the day shift, but the night shift. You in your bed, you, you ain't fixing no problems. All right? So I challenge you today, put it all in his hands. Because see, with man, nah, it ain't possible at all. Man, you talking about supernatural. You talking about God. You talking about the one who created you. In the natural, a vehicle. If something goes wrong with the vehicle, what should you do? Now, you might go get under the hood and pick around or whatever, but you don't know what you're doing. If a problem goes wrong with the vehicle, you take it back to the person who made it. You might be in there four minutes, tops. You walk in there, they're going to say, oh, OK, I already know. Yeah, when you open the hood, they're going to open the hood. They're going to go to the left side, boom, 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 fix the fuse, fix this, boom, 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 boom. Why? They're going to say, hey, man, look, we get these all day long. We might have had 80 of them this morning. The same year, the same model, we already know what the problems are for that year model. Why? Because, see, they made it. They understand what you're going through. Jesus been doing this way before you were born. Right? He understands your makeup. He knows what you need. He knows your trouble areas. But you got to fully submit your life to him. You got to invite him in on every single situation. All right? So something wrong with the vehicle, take it back to the person who made it, man. They specialize in that. And God specializes not only in you, but in your situation. So you got your own fingerprint. Man, I still can't believe I got my own fingerprint. Man, I look at this fingerprint every day, man. See, I'm one of one and you are too. No matter how uh, much I try, I can never be you. I do want to be like you, though. I ain't going to lie. I do. I do want to be like you. But I can't, though. See, your identity is with divinity. God wants to use you in a special way. You got a special tone in your voice. You got a special laugh. You got a special testimony. Nobody's been through what you've been through the way you've been through it. So allow God to use you. Put your life in his hands. Well, man, nah, that stuff ain't possible. But when you put your life in his hands, you're going to literally be able to see the things that God going to do through you. It's more than you can ever imagine, because at the end of the day, it's all about souls. God wants to use you to reach those souls. All right. Love you so much, man. You have an amazing day. See you in the very next video. Videos dropping every single day, man. Come back to the channel tomorrow. See you there tomorrow.